All right, hey guys, Mark from 42freeway.com. It's a beautiful Friday. Is it April 22nd? 22nd, down here in Cape May, New Jersey with my new friend Kyle here. We got a really interesting thing to uh, share with you guys. Kyle, what are we doing out here on the water? Uh, so uh, we're called Cape May Cycle Cruises and you can, book, uh, you can book trips with us. We basically take you out through the Cape May Harbor behind us here and we're gonna go on what we call a cycle boat tour. Um, if you aren't familiar with a cycle boat, uh, basically what we're sitting on right now is what we call our uh, cycle station. And it's a 10 person station around the bar and you can actually pedal underneath. We're, uh, we're pedaling right now and we're actually moving the paddle right in the back of the boat. Um, and uh, we can actually move the boat along and you can enjoy some beverages. We've got koozies here. Uh, if you want to mix up your own drink, we've got cups for you as well. And just come on, have a good time, listen to music with friends. Well, you know what's really cool about the setup? It really is set up like a bar. You have five down the end, five there. So you come with a group of friends. Yep. You're, you're, you got your beverage, which they bring their own beverages, of course, right? That's correct. Yes. They bring their own beverages. And you're sitting here right here with your buddies, your, your, whether it's a bachelorette party or a family on vacation, and just hanging out and drinking and having a good time. Yeah, and uh, the neat part about the bar is we have our coolers integrated right into the center. Oh. So when you need a refill, you just open up the cooler, and <laughs> uh, you can fill your uh, get get your next drink. You have a built-in holders for everybody. Yes. I mean this is this is great. We can actually bring up to twenty guests uh, on a private cruise. If you want to rent the whole entire boat out, bring twenty of your best friends and family. We have about seating for about eight up here. It's just lounge, and then of course our ten-person cycle station. Bathroom, of course. This is actually very nice. Yeah. Nice setup. Now, what? Talk about the pedaling. Everybody's gonna, everybody's gonna say, you know, immediately, oh, this is gonna wear me out. I don't, I don't want to. Yeah, exactly. That's everybody's main concern. Is uh, do I have to pedal? Absolutely not. We do have a motor. So if you want to sit back, relax, uh, we have a lounge area up front, or you can hang out with your friends on the bar station. Uh, the motor will uh, push you along. We'll make sure you get back to the dock. Uh, in time. It's like an old school steamboat paddle. It's, yeah. it's really cool. Um, and how, how that can drop in and you guys can control that. You're in Cape May, but it's the marina area off of Ocean Drive. Actually, Wildwood Crest isn't that far away, right? No. So Wildwood is uh, actually right down Ocean Drive here. You go over the toll bridge, uh, thoroughfare toll bridge, and you come right into uh, Wildwood, South yeah. Wildwood. Well, and actually the biggest, so the biggest landmark is we got the Harbor View Inn right here. Yeah, Harbor View is right here. Uh, right now, their outdoor restaurant is not open, but they do have an outdoor uh, restaurant bar and grill. Uh, so if you want, you can grab some food before or after your trip um, and you can grab a drink as well. So I'll, you know, we'll show the, the shot. Like literally, we are 25 feet from the corner of the uh, bar, the, the outdoor deck bar. So that's how close it is. So when you're coming here, you know, park, uh, well, first off, I saw your comment uh, to try and carpool as much as possible if you're coming yeah, down. Absolutely. Um, there's just, you know, it's a marina, right? There's limited parking here, but you know, park as close as you can to the, uh, to the restaurant and just walk along the decking that runs along that outdoor, the, the awesome outdoor bar area. Just walk along that and, you know, you guys got a prime spot right here. So. Yeah, it's awesome. We, uh, we're really looking forward to it. I think uh, it's going to be a really fun summer. Uh, just a quick quote uh, about the uh, driving situation. Just remember, guys, we are going to be, if you're planning on drinking, uh, make sure you have a designated driver with you because that's really important for us. Very, very, very fair. Now, what does the tour include? Like, where do you take people? Where do they go? And is there different lengths of time? How does that work? So, all of our tours are two hours. Um, if you want to go longer than two hours, just give us a call and we'll try to work out uh, something with you. Um, but basically, our route is going to be out the harbor and we're going to go past the Coast Guard base, which is right behind us. Um, we might be able to show you a shot of that later. Uh, we're going to go through the harbor um, and in towards the Cape May Canal. Uh, the canal, there's sometimes there's life on the shores. You can see foxes. Uh, it's almost a guarantee that you're going to see ospreys. Um, they're abundant around here. And um, from there, we're just going to make our way back. And um, that's pretty much it. We'll, uh, we'll be able to see some of the, the awesome scenery that we have here in the harbor, like all the big uh, yachts and sport fishing boats. What type of ocean life? I mean, do, do we get dolphins down here? Or do you go far enough out to actually see dolphins? 
So every once in a while, we get lucky enough to where the dolphins actually come into the harbor. So I won't say uh, it's very likely, but on the rare instance, we might see dolphins in the harbor while we're pedaling. Excellent. So you are, when does your season start? When are you starting the book? Uh, we're open this weekend. Uh, oh, great. This is our first weekend, April 23rd. Um, and we are running trips all the way until October 31st. So oh. uh, we're going to have a nice long season, plenty of time to get everybody in. And this is uh, probably a real easy online ordering system. Go to the website, pick your slot. And yeah, order. absolutely. So online, you can go right to our website, capemaycyclecruises.com. And um, Mark will have it linked in the video, I'm sure. And you can actually pick your tour. We offer, for example, if you want to book a uh, birthday party or a bachelorette party, uh, under our tours tab, you can just click right there and it'll bring you right to our current availability. So you don't have to call us and ask us if we have availability. It'll all show it right on our live calendar. And I imagine you can, you don't need a party of 10, right? You can, if you have, it's just two people, four people, you can, you can partially yeah. rent the boat. Okay. Yeah. So we'll we fill you in with other people. Yeah. We have, uh, we have options for that. Uh, currently we have about five or six time slots per week that we offer what we call a public cruise. Mm -hmm. So if you're a group of two or four, and uh, you don't have enough people to rent the whole boat out, then you can pick, uh, sorry, purchase your ticket and uh, join a group of, uh, of other people and make some new friends and have a good time. Awesome. We picked a beautiful day to come down here. Like the weather's just amazing. It's a little windy. It's amazing down here. Yeah. Let's hope it's that way for the rest of the season. I hope so. I can't, I'm definitely gonna come back and try this uh, with my friends. And yeah. uh, I have a couple friends that have places down here. I'll make it easy. So uh, I wish you a lot of luck, man. Anything else we need to know? Uh, no, I don't think so. Um, if you have any questions, you can call us. Uh, most of the stuff is on our website, so um, you can take a look there. We're going to be posting a lot on social media, on Instagram and Facebook. Uh, definitely give us a follow at Cape May Cycle Cruises on Instagram and Facebook. And uh, we'll be posting every trip so you can see how much fun you can have. Excellent. Keep doing it, man. That's one of my, it's one of my, I spend a lot of time on social media. It's one of my pet peeves up businesses. You know, when you go to that diner, see if they're open and the last yeah. post was from 2017, it's like, ah, now, you know, people are, people are looking and you know, you're going to excite people by showing them more of what's going on with the tourist thing. So. Absolutely. So, well, thank you, man. Thanks, Good luck Mark. to you. I appreciate it.